for a lot. So I bought a shoe for like $29.99 and it sold for over $100. I bought some shoes for $39.99 it sells for over $100. Hey sir, what's good everybody? I'm back and I'm better with another video. Today we're going to talk about how I made so much money reselling baby shoes right here. Baby sneakers all day every day. I have plenty of these. I have close to over 50 pairs on hand at every time, like all the time. Baby sneakers everywhere. So, um, I just want to quickly discuss how you can find baby sneakers and why you should start reselling baby sneakers and what prices I'm paying for baby shoes. And that would give you guys a general idea of um, how to look for Jordans and baby shoes that will make you a lot of profit. So, for me, uh, when I go into retail locations, there are certain stores that don't sell out of baby shoes. They don't have that much foot traffic. So that means there tends to be a lot of shoes left over. Most of the time, those shoes with, a, with not that much foot traffic tend to have a lower chances of selling baby shoes, especially like most mall sneaker stores will sell out of, um, of all the baby shoes. All the good stuff is gonna sell out. But like outside of the mall type of sneakers, you know, shopping center type of sneakers, stores though you don't have that type of clientele or foot traffic that comes in and buys these it's just people going around driving around they see a store they walk in buy some shoes they never really go that crazy and buy baby sneakers uh so how do i allocate how do i find these deals or how do i even get baby shoes to resell uh so my primary stores i like to go to are detail r shoe palace full locker sometimes but a lot of stores that will clearance items so for example on this shoe right here i think i paid 20 bucks or 30 dollars i have to check my thing but these are selling for over 50 bucks so you're not making like a lot of money but you're buying in volume and that's what i did and that's why i only have one pair i'm buying them in bulk just like this i think i bought seven pairs of these i could have bought like 20 pairs if i wanted but i just wanted to test the market out on these so i didn't really go that crazy on them but yeah, I'm, I'm buying maybe like 20, 15 pairs, and then there's multiple store locations that you can go to and buy these shoes from. So it's really easy pickings. If you're making 10 to $15 per shoe, you're only spending 30 bucks and you're turning that 30 to 50. You know, there's margins there. There's like great margins, and especially the, the cost that you're spending, you could do a lot of great things. So for example, today, I just picked this shoe up for, uh, I think I bought it for about 15 plus tax. But then I did have a 20% off, so I'm guessing it was about $13 per shoe. I just sold it for 30 bucks on Go app, and they just sold. Um, you're always able to find a lot of these baby shoes on sale at every type of retail and brick or mortar sneaker store, and they will be so cheap, dirt cheap. You can just buy them, resell them. And so now, what kind of shoes do you pick up at when you're looking to flip baby shoes? So for me, I tend to stay close to the to the trendy trendy um how do i say this i tend to stay close to the trendy year new sneakers that are coming out so 2020 we had a lot of jordan ones really being hyped up and selling out and stuff like that so i focused on baby shoes um in those smaller sizes now i don't pay retail price that's the thing guys i don't pay retail i only buy the shoes if it's clearance and there's margins for me to make some cash on right i just don't go into store on release day and buy baby shoes that's stupid I buy them once they go on sale, once they're clearance, stuff like that. Um, and that's how I got a bunch of these right here. They're only, I bought them for $43 after tax. I think they're selling for like $50, $60. So there's about like 10, I'd say $10 in profit. So they're retail at 50, they were discounted by $10. If I even sell them at retail, you know, making $7 a pair and I went to every store location and we bought close to 50 pairs of them. So you do the math, $10 at 50. 50 pairs and it wasn't that that hard of getting pairs because there's so many store locations of them and it was on my route to buy other shoes that I'm looking for to hold and flips just like just like these and stuff like that all right and uh, you always want to buy the clearance items and that's what I love I, they always go on clearance I buy them for really cheap I got these for like 40 some dollars they sell for a lot so I bought a shoe for like $29.99 and it sold for over a hundred I bought some shoes for $39.99 it sells for over a hundred and um, I don't know man it's kind of weird and crazy but it is what it is and the main reason I'm so successful at this is because there isn't that many sneaker resellers 
in that they sell for a lot. So I bought a shoe for like $29.99 and it sold for over a hundred. I bought some shoes for $39.99, it sells for over a hundred. And um, I don't know, man, it's kind of weird and crazy lane or even wasting their time to list baby shoes on those apps. So that means there's thousands of people with kids going on to StockX Go and trying to find baby shoes, but there isn't that many resellers trying to sell the baby shoes. And that's how I'm able to make a lot of profit off of them. Um, so a great example um, that I have really had good success with is these also right here. This colorway is really, really nice of the 270s. This is the first colorway they dropped. Everyone was liking these right here. And uh, these were on sale for about $9 or 20 bucks a pop. And I bought a lot of these. I sold these for an arm and a leg left and right. I bought the men's sizes, the grade school, and the PS. I bought them all and they really, really resold. Um, so if you want to get into buying and selling baby shoes you want to try to stand stay in that lane where everything is really popular you don't want it, any type of trash colorway you don't want any bricks nothing you want something that's really desirable so foam posits are really desirable um and the retail on these is 50 bucks so if i can buy them for 14 or 13 dollars after tax hey that's a bargain bro um same like this this is a jordan one black toe really jordan one black toes are really really hyped and like a brand new pair of man size of these are going for about three to four hundred bucks so if you want to stay in that lane you feel me like a brand new pairs of these are going for four hundred dollars in men sizing so i bought a lot of these baby shoes for 20 10 bucks pre-owned too and i buy them off people they have so many kids that wear the shoes but they really don't wear them as much and uh, that's just based on the sizing you feel me like they're not gonna take their kids outside some some sh kids don't even walk in them like that but like once you get to those bigger sizes they will dog the shoes so you want to learn the sizes and stuff like that but other than that man is just going to the store seeing what's on clearance looking at the app seeing what's uh what they're selling for and it's really great easy margin if you want to get into reselling baby sneakers i really want everybody to get into the resale game and try to figure out how can you buy baby shoes and flip them for a lot of money um so pretty soon we're gonna do the giveaway winner next up um i know i've been lacking i just want to record this little video so then um we have some content for the week you feel me so we're gonna just throw this out there on the internet we're gonna see what happens hopefully it does numbers um and it always when you're reselling baby shoes you want to find something that's garbage so i bought these for nine dollars a pop and i could easily sell them for 23 well i did sell them for over 23 dollars so it's really profitable but you just have to figure out the lane you want to get into the stores that will have the product that you're looking for and it takes a little bit of a time and trial and error but you once you put in the hours that's when you're going to see a lot of success in this game it's not an overnight type of thing so get out there grind find the baby lee is take you guys over um, to my baby shoe section so then we have a 10 minute video okay so here are all my baby shoes right here some of them they're they're selling out all the time bro like legit all day every day they come in they get processed and we're shipping shoes out all the time for for bro we're shipping shoes out all the time and it's so easy to resell it's so easy to resell baby shoes you just have to go out there find the deals but this light is too damn bright but yes sir ski um so i'm gonna show you guys a few of the shoes um let's see it's mostly most of them are similar colorways and that's this shoe right here goes for a lot of money and so i had to buy the baby shoes of version of it and i think these are all black toes right here oh nah these, these is it this is it this is these are selling for a lot of money too so i had to buy them flip them and it's just versions of really popular shoes that go for a lot these are black toes think these are something else Dude. sheesh sheesh oh yeah these are some jordan fours right here the what the fours really popular shoe sheesh but i, I think we got a 10 minute video already so uh next video i'm gonna show you guys uh what's up with this so guys, next video, I'm gonna show you guys what we're doing with this backdrop right here. 
Um, I'm gonna teach you guys how I buy resell mids. I have turned over a hundred thousand dollars to two hundred thousand dollars by just holding on to mids, and that's gonna be the next video. I hope you guys are ready for it. Uh, but now let me go um, edit this little video we are recording. <laughs> I got the mic going on, bro. So I hope it was recording the whole time. And other than that, I hope you guys enjoy this video. 